How did you get into composing for television and movies? Well, uh, uh, I always, at that time, it went, I, I was uh, recording a lot. I was with uh, uh, Capitol Records, and I was recording all the people like Nack and Cole, Peggy Lee, and Mel Tomé, and I was writing all their arrangements. And it was a wonderful job, but I, 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 my ambition at that time was always to write for movies. I always wanted to be a composer for movies. And television was more or less just beginning then for, for composers. And uh, I got a call once. Uh, uh, I was at Capitol, and they called me, uh, a fellow called me, and they said, uh, my name is John Green. I'm head of a music department at MGM. And we're, we're doing a, a picture with Mickey Rooney called The Strip. And uh, we thought you would be great because we haven't had a really a jazz score up to that time. Uh, so um, I went in and talked to them, and I, I, I did the music to the called the strip, and they loved the music, and they said, "Mike, we would love to hire you at MGM here." So I uh, met the, the uh, producer there. That uh, the picture's name was Joe Pasternak. At that time, he was the number one producer. He did all the musicals with uh, Esther Williams and Jane Powell and all those people. And I, make a long story short, I worked there for five years. I did all the, his music, uh, and, um, uh, like all the musicals with Lanza and Esther Williams, and like different people like that. And I stayed there for five years. And then one day I got a call from uh, Universal Pictures that they were, I knew the, the uh, producer there, uh, socially. And uh, he says, we're doing a, a, a television series called The Thriller with Boris Karloff. And we want your kind of modern music. And uh, I said, so I went there, I did the pilot, and they loved it, they loved it, and they said, well, we want you to do the series. And that just started me there, and I wound up there 15 years. I met the, this producer, who's a wonderful producer, Roy Huggins. And I did one after the other. I would do the thriller, and then I did the fugitive, and then Run for Your Life, and you name them. It went, went on and on and on for 15 years. It went from one big, big uh, series to another. Okay, and... Uh